hi i hope you are doing good so in this video i'm going to show you that how you can create drop down menu in cargo 3 as well as in cargo 2 uh, so yeah let's get started and if you haven't subscribed to the channel make sure you subscribe because uh, i'll be uploading more such content so we will be creating something like this and yeah let's get started uh, so this is the uh, this is my cargo 3 editor and after uh, like uh, currently i am having the black background and if you see all my text uh, all my text styling they are having white color so the text is of white color so you can adjust uh, this according to your site and after that hmm. First, uh, we, uh, we are going to create this using custom HTML and CSS because like there is no option in Cargo to cre create drop down menu from the settings. So I, I have created a blog in which uh, I have updated all the uh, all the local editor and paste it. So now as you can see that this is our uh, drop down menu and currently you can see all the mm, menu items here and paste this and now if you see when i hover on this uh, the drop down menu shows uh, the uh, sub menu 1 and sub menu 2 if you go in the code section uh, i have i have created like they are created using the button tag and you can target and change the CSS using the uh, drop BTN class and uh, the submenu item like drop down one, drop down two. If you see, then they are in the H1 tag. So you can customize this by going to the heading one, and then if you want, you can change the color like this, and you can change the font size as well uh, if you want, and line height as per your need. So yeah, that's how you can tweak with all the changes and uh, like currently it is um, you can see they are uh, up on uh, they are uh, in the whole screen what you can do you can just go in the local setting and change the page width something like this and if you see that the contact this is I guess the heading one also we can make this as body copy and uh, we can change the body copy styling form here uh, to make it similar to the button so yeah you can do this thing and now you can see that mm, our menu is looking something like this make sure to pin this so that it is present in every page currently it is not looking let me just set another pages home page and now you can see that this is our menu and this is the home page so yeah that's how you can add the mm. and the drop down menu you can customize the menu css from here like you can change the background color and the box shadow uh, change the font family all these things from here if you want and uh, yeah if you have uh, any doubt you can go to the support support for forum and here you can ask your uh, questions in the i guess in any of the you can go in the design or design and layout or cargo 3 section or custom code you can add your question here and now let's see how to do this in cargo 2 so here uh, let me create a new page this one is also going to be similar and this is our menu and let me make this design as black and after that let me go back to the drop down menu and now go to the code view section paste it here it is some looking something like this let me reduce the padding padding bottom and after that Go to the design tab and 
CSS editor. And after that, you can paste the CSS from here. As you can see now, currently it is looking like this because this is the H1 tag. So what you can do, you can go in the menu section and change the H1 property, something like this. And I can make this as Okay, let me change this. Now, as you can see, it is looking something like this. I can decrease the drop the uh, font size and increase the line height. And uh, if you want, I can, you can decrease the width of the menu to make it look closer like this. Uh, so yeah, I hope uh, you have found this uh, video helpful. And if you like my content, you can go in the uh, buy me a coffee section and yeah uh, s support me uh, so th thank you so much you can ask uh, doubt in the forum section if you have any i hope you have enjoyed this video